What is it, everybody? It's Freshman Studios here, back with another video. Today, we're going to go over how you can install Optifine and ultimately install shaders in Minecraft on your Mac in 2021 for 1.16.4 on the M1 on Big Sur. So, it is very simple here. We're going to go ahead and get this mirror installation downloaded here uh, because we are on the Mac. So, we can go ahead and allow the downloads there. In the meantime, we're going to go ahead and go to the Java official website and download Java for Mac OS X. Both of the links will be in the description. So what you're going to want to do first, go ahead and open up that uh, Java uh, DMG file here. Get that installed. Knock that out to Java 8 updates to 71. If you guys have any problems, make sure you go to system preferences. So it does need to require my password. Okay, so if you guys are having any problems with that installing, um, any problems at all, go to security and privacy. Make sure allow apps download from is either on App Store and Identify Developers or anywhere. Um, and you should be good to go or you may have to manually allow it there but go ahead and install it uh, the Java here this is obviously from the official Java Oracle so it's fine quick side note here for whatever Minecraft version you want Optifine on you're gonna have to install it individually you're gonna have to re install it for each version so say let me close this out real quick you open this up real quick install this it's gonna do its thing I'm the fine successfully installed so you're gonna have to do that for each version so say you're playing 1.16 and you want to go back and play 1.8 Optifine will not be on for that, so you're going to need to go and install Optifine for that as well. And then if you want to go back to 1.16, you're going to have to reinstall the 1.16 version. kind of sucks, but it is what it is. So we also want to go ahead and download some shaders. So I'm going to just do the light version right here, or the medium version. We'll see how this goes on this brand new Mac. We're also going to go get the Project Luma. Um, there's plenty of videos out there on YouTube, so let's make sure we get... Does it not have the 1.16? Alright, so now that you have that installed, you can go ahead and go home. And then you're going to want to either do show view options and show the library folder. Or you can simply go to go and press the option key on your keyboard. Go to library. And then because... Uh, well, Minecraft, you actually... Hold on. You're going to have to run it one time uh, and make sure that it is installed properly. So Optifine, you're going to have to run that once before you can do this but in the meantime let's go ahead and bring it up so you're going to want to go to application support application support then you're going to want to go to minecraft and you're going to see shader packs now that you've run minecraft that is now open so if we go into the shader packs here what you're going to need to do is drag and drop these all in there all right so actually I, since i opened it up we have beyond belief is already in here i'm here i'm going to show you guys the reason why these other ones aren't working so if we got Beyond Belief Legacy here, that will open. For some reason, some of them aren't working right. Beyond Belief just never seems to work for me. It didn't work on the other ones either. So you're going to need to create a shell pack called Shaders. Um, let's just put Shaders 1 right there. You're going to put this in there. Do the same thing here. We can do. We can actually name it whatever we want. Um, and then just make sure that says Shaders so that we have a shell pack. And then once you have that, so the, the name outside can be whatever it wants. That's why this is fine. Um, just inside of that folder, it needs to be shaders. So now we go back to Minecraft. You will see shaders is now here. So we can switch to that. So I downloaded some more shaders here. The other ones were crashing my system. So uh, we're going to go ahead and throw those in there. And once we go into there, you need to make sure you rename this to just simply shaders. A shader pack loaded up right now on the default Minecraft textures. Um, as you guys can see, uh, this one does not actually have shadows far as I can tell here but um it does have water and the sun so here's another one that I have installed and this one is absolutely destroying my frame rate um but you guys can see uh the shaders they, they're here so I'll switch no problem okay this one holy frick dude this one's insane comparison we got some shadows the water is not done leaves kind of have a little bit of a texture going on the sun comes through the leaves a little bit and i did i think i have the the fast leaves right now too but we're getting consistent 60 fps which is oh this is dope i got the stylized uh demo pack on right now and then i got the uh, shaders so uh this looks pretty decent hey bro you want a screen all right well the one who was, which was crashing earlier i got it to work 8 fps ain't gonna cut it but it's gonna make the game the cow gonna get a screenshot what it do baby hope you guys did enjoy this video i know how to install resource packs texture packs um or how to install maps in minecraft on a mac uh, check out my other tutorials and if you guys want to learn to get final cut pro for free i also have a tutorial for that also photoshop and logic pro 
So I got some great stories out there, but if you guys want to stick around for the long haul, I got weekly videos, uh, challenge videos uh, for Instagram, making money uh, online through Instagram, crypto, stuff like that. So stay tuned, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.